Hey everyone, what's naturalism to you? Almost fell there. To me, naturalism is getting back to nature. If you've been in Atlanta, where you're surrounded by the concrete jungle of cars and freeways and skyscrapers, right? Well, I've got news for you folks. There is another Atlanta, and that's right out here. Uh, in fact, I'm standing in it. This is suburban Atlanta. We're way out. We get 70 miles. We live here. This is still part of the metro area. And just outside of what we call the perimeter, outside 285. But this is our backyard right back here. It's cool, isn't it? You know? So if I ever want to get back to nature, all I've got to do is just walk right over into this area here, or down here, or get lost over there, right? And, uh, you know, if I ever want to discover the city in the suburbs, all I've got to do is go up, well, the streets over there, and drive into town. There are many places like this around here. In fact, so many that I remember uh, there were reports of Bigfoot being around here, but it turned out to be just a hoax. Some guy who's actually, uh, I think, a Clayton County Sheriff or a police officer was uh, pretending to be a Bigfoot and he went around the country on this tour and all that. <laughs> That's pretty wild, you know. But uh, the bottom line is you can enjoy nature out here. Uh, I'm looking for Bigfoot. I wonder, do you think Bigfoot really exists? But if Bigfoot existed, what would I do? Oh, man. If there's any other place in the entire country where Bigfoot might be other than Washington, it would probably be around here somewhere, but not in this backyard. Hey, I, I'm all for naturalism, okay? But that's taking it to the end. Yeah? Maybe that's Bigfoot now. That's our septic tank. That's not, that is, that is not Bigfoot's home. Okay? That's, no. Um, I can't find any footprints here either. No, not at all. No. No, no signs of Bigfoot. That, that, that's our barn over there. No signs of Bigfoot. Oh, and you see those, you can't see those wires over there, but at night, I'll tell you something, if Bigfoot came around here, boy, those wires would really give he or she. It's funny how we always assume that Bigfoot's a, a he, right? A hurt, I don't want to hurt a defenseless animal, though. Uh, uh, if you are Bigfoot, please, want to be treated right, I make a great steak. Naturalism in it. <laughs> and by the way, I am your Atlanta vid blogger.